Hey everybody, what's up? So I watched the um, Detroit Lions and the uh, Washington Commanders today. And uh, Detroit just simply, simply outplayed played the commander. They, they outplayed them. It looked like, if I was to judge it, that um, Detroit was playing at like a level 10. And Washington was playing like a level 5 or 6. So that's one key point I had in the game. I just think their intensity level, um, the way they played was a lot faster and a lot more aggressive than Washington played today. It seemed like Detroit was more ready for the schemes that Washington was going to put forth in front of them, like the defenses that Washington laid out, the offensive schemes that Washington laid out. Detroit, their offense was ready for what Washington was uh, throwing at them. Offensively, defensively, special teams, they dominated all three phases of the game. Um, since, you know, those of you who, and those of us who've been watching football for a long time, or if you played it, you know that the line of scrimmage is a big thing. If who can win the line of scrimmage, a lot of times will win the game. And when I watched the game, Detroit dominated the offensive line and defensive line. They dominated both lines. Um, Carson Wentz was back there. He was taking some big shots today. They were pressuring him big time. Um, their defensive line dominated our offensive, dominated the Washington offensive line, and their offensive line also dominated Washington's defensive line. I mean, they were running like right up the middle. They were running like what I would call in football like the zero one hole, right, right over the center of these inside zone plays. They were just gashing them ten, eight, ten yards a carry. And so Detroit just outplayed them. You know, I was really, I was impressed with Detroit's intensity today with their passion. Um, Washington, like I said, they weren't. They weren't, uh, you know, at that level today. They just weren't, weren't weren't ready. They weren't prepared. They weren't ready to play. Um, Detroit took it to them today. Um, Carson Wentz, you know, he did, you know, it's his second game. He's now one and one as the quarterback for the Washington Commanders. Um, you know, he, he as a quarterback, you rely on your offensive line. They got to protect you. Um, or the coaches got to move you around a little bit. Seems like they had him sitting in the pocket a lot. Um, Detroit was just teeing off. You know, Washington really couldn't run the ball, so they knew they they weren't really worried about that. Um, I thought Brent Wentz still played well in the second half. He did some good things. Um, you know, he kind of started to bring him back into the game, so it shows me he played with some toughness, some grit. Um, he wasn't going to just throw the towel in, despite being beat up the whole game. He was still giving it everything he had. Um, but I think overall, um, Detroit, their intensity, they just seemed like they wanted it more. They wanted the game. They were more passionate about it, and they they took it to them. A lot of times, when you when, from the from when you're a little kid playing football, your coach will tell you, the team that's hitting the hardest, the team that's getting off the ball, the team that's uh, making contact and, and and underneath playing underneath their shoulder pads, they're they're playing lower. They did all those fundamentals today. The things that you've been taught since you were five years old playing football, Detroit did it today. They owned the line of scrimmage. They played harder. They played with more intensity in all three phases, special teams, offense, and defense. And the score showed that. So uh, it's back to the drawing boy for the Commanders. Carson Wentz now 1-1 one one as the quarterback of the Commanders. And uh, we'll see what happens next week. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and message. And I'm interested in talking here what you guys have to say. Peace.